going past this, ready for inspection. Thank Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Adi Bayoli Bambi and you're definitely welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time stopping by, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, turn on your post notifications and definitely come back to watch all my previous videos and more videos to come. So, and if you're, if you're a returning subscriber, you're definitely welcome back to my channel. Thank you for always coming back. It is officially five minutes to seven and we are about to start the journey from Akure to Lagos. Big thing. The other way, the other way. Oh, sorry. We've eventually gotten the big star. Where is it now? It should be the second one in front. You even know it's past me. The owner of the thing. Cover your visa number. I cover it. I will blank it off. Trust me. All right. Easy. It's not easy, you guys. Though now I'm about to go to the airport because we're leaving the same day we collected it, and I'm sending my bike to Nigeria eventually. <laughs> Daddy's calling us. He's so, why do they like disturbing our videos? <laughs> so, we're finally doing what? She's we're going leaving. Bye. We're going to the airport. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't cry. Ah, but you guys, it's, it's good. been long overdue. We're going to see ourselves in a year. Yes. In a year or two. We're going to be doing a new pause. I'm gonna get a new boyfriend and she's not gonna know! <laughs> <laughs> so, basically that's what's up, right? So when I start dating to marry, she won't be around, obviously. Uh, when me so I start dating to marry, where are you? Where? <laughs> My flight is for, what, 7 o'clock? And it is currently to 2. So I want to eat. I made it to Doha. I'm trying to get to my connecting flight so that I can on my boarding gate. Yeah. So I have to pack my hair because me wrap around. I can't come and die. But that's what's happening right now. So. Okay. 
waiting to board. We started calling us. Uh, everything is happening so fast. So, so fast. It is. Seven fifteen door time and already boarding. So this one is going to be like another seven hour flight. And I bought it like my book book is pink. We'll get there. One second, ladies and gentlemen, we are inviting customers to enter London, sit in zone number one and zone number five to please kindly proceed ahead for boarding. We request customers to please have your boarding passes ready for inspection. Thank you. and series of questions so I'll keep you guys process and clearance and all those things and I will check in with you guys once I am done so hey guys I'm here um ready at the UK border though the queue is mad but it's moving Moving very smart. Uh, I think this is where I'm going to go to, to go and get my passport stamped. My visa stamped for my passport. I have this seat and now just get myself a permit check. And yeah, but the queue is a lot. It's moving very yes. a lot. Yeah. I already got two of my bags. It remains a hand of much. And yeah, I'm done. I also already went through passport control. They already checked. Not so much questions, funny enough. Not too much questions. I'm moving on. I'm waiting for my bag, my um, hand of much, and shall proceed. And then we shall proceed to our final destination. Which I don't even know how I'm going to get home yet. Maybe I'm going to go by by train or I'm going to book a car. I don't know. But this is what's happening so far. Being here has been less stressful. Just that I don't know how to climb that that machine. That's the gate that is always moving by itself. Whether going down or up, I walked my ass off because I don't know how to climb it and I cannot disgrace myself. Not today of all days. I'm not interested in disgracing my, disgracing myself. So. That's what's going on. That's what's happening right now. Waiting for my mini bag. And then once I'm done, I got, I collected the in the this mini gave me this. Let me show you guys. Let me show you guys. They gave me this um 
sausage or something, something, something. I wasn't going to eat it all, but I collected it just so that it should, in case, you know, I'm hungry later. I have something to eat because, ah, oh, I'm tired. I said to my second flight, shall but a little bit. Maybe like, because my second flight was seven hours. So I'm sure I slept for like, what, five minutes. And yeah, let me say one hour. Plus all the breaking in, waking up, being like this and everything. One hour. And I had not slept in three to four days. So in three to four days, I've only slept for an hour. And I'm still working on, that means I'm literally working on zero. Zero. I'll, tell you guys, I'll talk to you guys when I get my bag or once I get my bag you have to open your eyes in this place before somebody else mistakenly you takes your bag because by the time I got here somebody already dropped my bag off the machine that pulls it off so I had to just and check the tag to make sure that it was my name on it yeah so this is the part where nobody shows you guys and nobody talks about it. but I landed uh I'd say an hour, an hour and a half ago, an hour and a half here. And although it took time to go through checkpoints and also get my bag and also call my mom and my dad and just see everybody. Now that that's all done, we're trying to get, I'm trying to get a cab to where I'm going to. And man, it's too expensive. So I eventually got a guy that will be taking me over, but because of the price, we're trying to see if we can get one or two more persons so that it could be cheaper. So I'm currently sitting out outside and waiting for the next customer to come around. Everybody just comes to come and talk about, oh, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. They don't tell you the real deal. I'm going to tell you guys the real deal. I don't even know if you guys can hear me, but let me shout so they can hear me because it's outside and it's noisy. But I'll just let you guys know when I get a cab. I think it's my house. No house, my room, apartment, anyone. Just to keep me to be a place to sleep in tonight. 